Hey guys, welcome back to another new video. This video is specifically going to be for people with ultra wide monitors. It's anyone with a 21 by 9 aspect ratio monitor. If you guys have been watching my channel for a while or watch this studio tour that I have pulled up right here, you will notice that that's the kind of monitors that I have. And one thing that really drives me nuts is anytime I want to try to watch YouTube or Netflix, if I go full screen with stuff, you can see that I have the black bars on the side. And the reason behind this is because the video is formatted for 16 by 9 aspect ratio and mine's a 21 by 9. So you don't have that extra part of the video right there. And you can see if I put this down real quick and go over to Netflix and do a full screen with Netflix, Netflix has the same problem. Now, as far as Netflix goes, I haven't found any content that's actually specifically 21 by 9. I do know on YouTube though that you can't upload 21 by 9 videos. I specifically don't do it just because there's not enough people that watch my content that I know that has specifically 21 by 9 aspect ratio. So I stick with the more common, more viewable 16 by 9. Now I have found a workaround for this. Uh, so far it's only in Chrome. I haven't really did a lot of research with other browsers. It is browser based though. It's a plugin for it. If you go to the Chrome web store and search ultra wide video, you will pull up this plugin right here. I'll leave a link down in the description just to make it easier for you. But basically what this does is it stretches the video or crops the video, basically whatever you tell it to do. And basically with this plugin installed, I can go over to a YouTube video. And if I do full screen, you'll see that it still has the black bars. But if you go up here to the plugin itself and click on it, I can do aspect ratio or I can do crop. Now aspect ratio, what that will do is pull the video to the side and make it a little bit wider, which sometimes looks a little bit unnatural. It's not that bad to look at. It's definitely better than the black bars on the side. Now your other option is crop. So let me go up here, select that. And when I go into full screen, you'll notice it cuts off the top and bottom. Now for a lot of videos, that's not a big deal because there's not a lot of information at the top and bottom. A lot of people like to keep the information right in the middle. But if you do find that that's an issue, that's when you can do the aspect ratio. Now, if you noticed, this works when I go full screen and only works when I go full screen. When I have it normal mode, there is no crop, there is no stretching, there's no kind of visual effect there. And as you can see, if I go over to Netflix and I do the full screen, it works on Netflix also. And then if I go back, it'll put it back to normal. Uh, one thing I did notice though, is there is some websites to where these features don't work. And what you need to do is you need to go into force mode, which they say is experimental. So sometimes it doesn't work the greatest. So what you can do is say, if I do force crop, you'll see that it cropped it automatically. That's not when it's in full screen mode. These up here control when it goes into full screen mode, these down here are just force modes in general. So it'll force any kind of video content that it detects. Which, like I said, is good for some other websites because some websites don't detect that you're using this. But from what I can see, I've never had a problem with YouTube or Netflix. Uh, one thing I did notice on Netflix is if you're watching a lot of videos in a row, sometimes the crop doesn't go over to the next video. So what you need to do is you need to just go out of full screen and go back in full screen. It doesn't do that on YouTube, though. It detects that it's a different video. Now, it's not a perfect solution, but this is a way for the people like me with a widescreen aspect ratio can watch videos and not have the annoying black bars on the side. Honestly, I'd rather have something stretched than have the black bars on the side. It just really gets annoying. And sorry if this video has been a little bit talky. I'm going to try to edit out as much as I can because I kind of rambled on a little bit in here. But if you like this video, go ahead and like it. Subscribe if you want to see more content like this, and I will see you guys next time.